there aren't very many vehicles in jailbreak I don't own yet and one of those is the reasonably new Airtail so I am very close you can see I'm at 594,000 I need 600,000 so that's just 6,000 that can be like one cargo ship robbery and in this video I'm gonna get the Airtail and then compare it to some of the other vehicles I already own Oh, there aren't very many criminals on this server. Okay, power plant and then something else will probably be enough to get me to the 600,000. Wait, I can just rob the gas station to get the money I need. This very simple robbery will get us to the 600,000. There was someone camping the airport as a police officer. They're dead now. <laughs> Yeah, the weird thing with the airtail is how the middle seat is the one where you drive. So I'm gonna go and put a level 5 engine in this and everything and then I'll give it a tester. It's backwards acceleration, it's very quick. Okay, so here I'm gonna compare the airtail to the roadster. So I think the Roadster has a faster acceleration, but the Airtail's top speed may be quicker. Now the Airtail has the spawn in the military base, which could be very helpful for police officers if they happen to spawn there. But I think the Roadster's spawn point might be a bit more useful for criminals because it's like right in the city. Generally, I would say it's more helpful to have a slightly slower top speed and faster acceleration. So I'd say that makes the Roadster better in a way. So the Roadster, I feel, is still probably better than the Airtail overall. Now, the Airtail is still really good and could be very helpful if you're at the military base or the airport and isn't very far behind the roadster but in my opinion I would probably suggest still getting the roadster. I think that's where we're gonna have to end today's video. Hopefully this has helped show you the airtail and decide whether you want to get it or not. Like, subscribe, hit that bell to get notified. Bye!